Uh, why are you refusing to tell me what the punishment is? Shouldn't the public be able to know? I think HR is the spokesperson for our district. This edition of the Ridley Report is brought to you by... Freekeen.com Well, now I'm outside the Keen School Board meeting uh, on uh, May 12th, the day, I guess, that the news broke, I think, in the local paper that an elementary teacher has allegedly assaulted an elementary student. Specifically, the superintendent has admitted, uh, according to the Sentinel, uh, according to an email that they published, admitted that an elementary teacher inappropriately handled an elementary student leaving a mark on the student's neck. By the way, what you're seeing now is not video of the elementary school, but of the high school where the school board meetings take place. So what I want to do, of course, is get a sense for uh, whether board members will answer questions about this alleged assault, whether the superintendent will do so. Also, I want to clarify, the student was a fifth grader. I'm not sure if that qualifies them as a, uh, an elementary student in Keene Dictionary. It may qualify them as a middle school student, I'm not sure, but in either case, uh, a fifth grader considered to be an elementary school student in some districts. Again, this is according to the Sentinel. That's all I have to work with right now is what the Sentinel is saying. And today, uh, students staged a protest, apparently, right out in front of Keene High School. Uh, I guess the sign read uh, justice for, well, whatever the student's name was, but I didn't, uh, I didn't see the protest. Maybe someone else has some shots of it that I will be able to obtain. Business. Ma'am, you're on the board, correct? Can you tell me what the exact punishment I will be? I can't. Be for the uh, no teacher that allegedly assaulted the student? I, I understand you are punishing them, but what's the punishment? Was there any video obtained of the uh, of the alleged assault, the alleged incident? Will the public be able to view that video if so? Do you guys have security cameras uh, at the school where the alleged assault occurred? Was there a camera in the library where I guess it allegedly occurred? back in here doing the shut everybody out thing. Maybe they're talking about the, uh, the teacher who allegedly committed the assault. Something they probably aren't going to do for me, but that's all right with me. I just as soon get video of people walking off as talking to me for five minutes. Superintendent, what is the, alleged, what is the, what is the exact punishment that you guys have meted out to this alleged assault teacher? Uh, you know, I, I think you want to talk to HR. Um, because any internal employee issue is, um, the HR is our spokesperson. Well, you're in charge of the show, right? So you know what the punishment is, correct? I'm sorry, I, have, I don't have any other comment. Uh, why are you refusing to tell me what the punishment is? Shouldn't the public be able to know? I think HR is the spokesperson for our district. HR here today inside yes. that meeting? Yep, there are two. What's the HR person's name? Uh, Tim Rohr is the director of HR. Okay, I may ask him a question. Are students safe in your school? Should they still be forced to come here if they're getting allegedly assaulted? Why does your budget seem to go up every year? The Dover New Hampshire School District only spends ten grand a year, but I understand you spoke you folks spend fifteen grand per student per year. Why is that? Was there any video taken of the alleged assault and will that be made available to the public? You've seen the dramatic liberty arrests in Keene, New Hampshire. Now see 111 reasons why you should move there and reinforce these gutsy activists.
Keen's advantages are compelling, and the list of reasons to move has just been updated. For details, visit freekeen.com.